To the average person, this may just look like a farm, but to Vonda McCoy, it looks like opportunity. So this was our ticket to freedom. Did the farm animals need this ticket to freedom? No. The animals are just a fun addition to the special needs daycare known as Drake's Place. Before, he didn't really, because I'm a full-time working mom, he didn't really have a lot of playtime with other kids and like associations outside. He never got invited to birthday parties or anything like that. So this is a place where he's already made long-term friends for a year. They have sleepovers. Um, a couple weeks ago, he stayed for the first time all night long, and they tie-dye clothes, and they played with glow-in-the-dark sticks, so he just gets to do what regular kids do. And honestly, this place is super cool. They have horses and chickens and swings, and if it's if the, the older your child gets when they have special needs, the harder it is because they age out of regular daycares. And that's what makes Drake's place different. Once they're 10 or 11, and if they're not potty trained, you can't send them to a daycare. Um, and most places don't know how to handle them. But here, they're understanding. They know if somebody's having a meltdown or somebody's having a bad day, or whatever the case may be, they're not going to send them home because, oh, you know, your child's being a brat. Then I understand that. Vonda says the purpose of Drake's Place is to build a sense of community and lasting relationships that will help these young people in the long term. So I also understand a bit more about the community and how great the need is for relationships, for friendships, for a purpose outside of making everyone else around you a better person. They're worth more than that. So that has led into, you know, it, it doesn't end here. You're in school and you're little for just a short while and then you're an adult. So we're in the process now of also trying to get the young adults transitioning from high school into adulthood into a, a daycare or a work center, a program of some kind where they can maintain relationships and have a purpose and serve the community. Reporting for Gaylord News, I'm Reed Lindsay.